And welcome back, friends, family, loved ones, enemies, haters, and everything in between. Whatever that could be. To Dead Space Hard Mode. This is Chapter 2. Let me just uh, reorient myself with controls real quick here. Because uh, it's been about a week and a half since I've played. Uh, unfortunate, but what can you do, mate? All right. So we were doing something with uh, a hydrazine tank. Exciting. Hydrazine. Um, sounds a bit like something that would help me with acne, right? But I don't think that's it. Uh, ooh. I remember this bit. Does he come back to life? I don't remember. Well, not on my watch. He didn't. He didn't. All right. Fill that up. Is it why that did the? Yeah. I guess it's. I guess it's maybe more clear than I gave it credit for. <laughs> it's when you have the light on it. It's not actually. But <laughs> wonder if that was intended, like a balancing thing. Why is my voice so high? I don't know. I'm just so scared. I'm so scared of what's happening in this game. It's too spooky. Look at that. That's so spooky. He was attached to my foot. Alright. No power on that. Anything over here? Nope. Just gotta move it, move it. Get back in there. All right. Uh -huh. How's everyone doing? I'm doing great. Doing wonderful. I'm sure as soon as I... I! <laughs> I uh, should have just uh, done that first. Okay. Oh, it goes right there. My 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 mistake. Oops. Oh, shit. What is it? Okay, it's B. <laughs> It's not that many buttons, but it still trips me up. It still trips me up. He's got COVID. Oh, God. And this guy's got super COVID. Security clearance? Come on. Ain't got time for that. Power node. Um, oh, I shouldn't have reloaded there. It would have been nice to see if... Um, oh, wait, and we do have a pulse rifle. That's right. So, we get additional upgrades on this. So, I already got that. Or, I didn't. Haha. <laughs> um... Yeah, let's do that. And capacity. Uh. Yeah, we'll hold on to those. What does that say? Hey, it's okay to be fucked up. It sure is. You know, that's a great, that's a great, uh, valuable lesson to know. You know. Uh, as, as long as it's not a, a toxic degree of uh, fuck uppery, uh, you're okay. You know? So, if you're just a little bit fucked up, uh, shine on, you, you crazy diamond, as they say. Okay. Where's this other. Where, where's this other battery that I'm presumably looking for? Huh? 
Speaking of a little fucked up, I got oh, maybe a little bit heated in the last episode. Uh, <laughs> just, uh, yeah, I, I stand by what I said. I just felt like, you know, maybe that's just going a little too intense for a, a kind of a casual let's play of a spooky game. Maybe, maybe we don't need to do that. Uh, yeah, we do need a second. Oh, wait, it's for this thing. That's right. Completely forgot about that. Uh, so let's turn on the doors uh, first because I want to go that way before we go up but yeah I mean it's a intense time right like you think about all the stuff Hogwarts Legacy and JK Rowling and New York Times giving a puff piece of like it's dangerous to call her a transphobe and it's yeah it's hard not to it's hard not to feel intense uh, rage about that Given the reports from the colony, he's lucky to have his faculties at all. Well, a divine experience would leave an impression on anyone's mind. Perhaps. But I saw nothing divine in all that... blood. The suicides. But this is a revelation, Terence. We just need more insight to... translate it. Do you think this insight can be found in Mr. Harrison's psyche? I'm positive. And with Captain Matai following any physical images... Yeah, I think <laughs> I'm gonna try that. What? What the fuck? Why did that? Why was that so violent? Uh, anyway, let's see. The capacity upgrade gives us some free ammo. A la Resident Evil 4. And I think the other Dead Space games, it sure does. That's awesome. Yeah, the main reason I decided to just. Uh, uh, get rid of the more intense uh, <laughs> statement that I made is just that, like, j just mainly the feelings of uh, how much of the transphobia and, you know, all of the hatred stuff and all of the, like, irrational nastiness that people have, how much of that is because of uh, the people in power, right? And because of, uh, b because of you know, media doing bad things, right? And that sort of stuff. Politicians, right? Uh, okay, let's do that. So, uh, yeah, it just got me kind of thinking, especially the way that, you know, really young people get manipulated by that and get radicalized like that. That makes me really sad to think about, like, back to how intense things have been uh, uh brianna a uh, jai her murder right and that the suspects there were like 15 year old kids it's so it's really depressing stuff right it's and it's uh yeah Pro probably not stuff i should comment on because <laughs> it's so um is it this way yeah so what what is in this room but yeah Anyway, that's that's why I edited out some audio there because it's such a it's such a dark thing, right? And, uh, but we still kind of feel like I feel like we should talk about it, right? Because if you don't, you're kind of part of the problem in a completely different way. So yeah, uh, let's just say uh, fuck transphobes and uh, move on. Yeah, good stuff. Oh, okay. Hey, hey, hey. How'd you do that? All right. Good to know I can get spooked by this game. That's good to know. Good to know. Ooh, a save. Gotta save it. All right. 
One hour and 11 minutes in. Reminds me of um, eight hours before 9 11 happened. <laughs> oh, okay. Good one. Good one, Zach. Good one. What do we got here? Pang! There's always Pang. I've said that. I came up with that. I was born saying there's always Pang. Actually, you take the N out of it, and uh, that's what I say uh, every day now. I don't have all the time in the world for this, but uh, enough time. Actually, hang on here. Before. Since that's such a short uh, segment, oh, I make sure there's nothing I was missing here. Uh, vacuum, I can't. Uh, it's a. There's no zero G here, right? Doesn't appear so, and I don't see anything obvious that I could have missed. So let's proceed. Zero gravity. Caution. By a sec medical center. Huh. Aha, here we go. The lighting of this is so good. Really kind of blows me away. Boink. Boink. Oops. All right. Uh, so there. Uh, reset our orientation. Nice. This feels really good. Like that was one of the coolest things about the original Dead Space was uh, how the, the zero G aspect and the fact that it controlled well. Because I. I imagine that's got to be a tough thing for game developers to pull off, right? And not be easy. Think about how hard it is to make a good controlling game in just like two dimensions of movement, or even one. <laughs> then add zero gravity into the mix there? Bonkers, bonkers. Oh, here we go. Still holding this position. What's happening there? Isaac will Did no longer have cold? acne. No sign of her yet. But I found some hydrazine that should work on the barricade. I just need to find a shock pad. Okay. Work fast, Isaac. Wouldn't think the barricade would have zit and blackhead problems, but... Hey, I'm no barricade expert. Zero gravity. All right, now there are monsters. Here there be monsters. I don't... I don't see monsters. Ah! Oh. Is it dead? Yeah. <laughs> it's dead and it's in space. How uh, shocking. Whoa, is this... Are these people in stasis? Oh, weird. Do you think maybe we should wake them up? Let them know what's going on? <laughs> yeah, I feel like that would be a, a good idea. But what do I know, huh? Shut the whole ship. I'll check it out. The hell? Hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> so we could do this the whole time. The whole time we could do this? There's an oxygen tank. How nice. Uh, there, 
they aren't giving me total freedom here. Uh, it's not too surprising, probably. Whoa! Did that... Did that hurt me? I don't think so. How nasty. So... Can't wait till we get uh, security clearance. Ah! Shit. <laughs> you jerk. So it's interesting they die, like, right as soon as you cut a limb off. That's interesting. Oh, elevator. Why is this elevator not? Oh, we're still in zero gravity. Neat. Actually, that thing was floating, so that, that should have been uh, <laughs> more clear to me than it was. That thing, he almost got me. You okay? I trapped him in a damaged escape pod. He's snarling like, this is fucked up. Hurry, Isaac. Have you seen if he's just hungry? That's possible. Pulse round schematic, good. I need to remember to, that I have that weapon. <laughs> It'll probably be helpful at a certain time. Let's let's try it on now, actually. Oh dear. Okay, and that's still alive. That's a very dismaying witness. B to heal, right? Yes. It's almost like I've played the other Dead Space games several times, so even taking a semi-long break from this one doesn't mean a whole lot. Could that be true? Could it be true? Hmm. Oh, that's where that's why that guy had a real headache. Ha! Okay. Like, uh, uh, we took a second pass at that, and it's only just then that I came up with the the, uh, the hackiest of all puns I could possibly come up with there. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, so we could sell... Sell that. Still... I kind of like to... I don't know if I should buy another nude. How's our in 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 inventory looking? Kind of crappy on the pulse rounds, not gonna lie. Eh, we'll save our cash. Do we want to be in a situation where we find ourselves with not enough cash? I uh, am wondering if I'm going to play the uh, uh, Resident Evil 4 remake. Well, I'm definitely going to play it. What I mean is for the YouTube. For you. Will I play Resident Evil 4 remake for you? Uh, it's possible. It's definitely possible. Game looks phenomenal, by the way. Uh, I am very open to... Uh, okay, hang on a sec. I'm very open about the Resident Evil 4 remake, I, uh, even as a super fan. Like, I would say Resident Evil 4 is my favorite game of all time, and I am like, hell yeah. I'm down to play this remake here. I, and I'm okay if it's not as uh, cornball and cheesy. It doesn't look like it's going to be, because we'll always have the original game on every platform known to man, right?
Oh, okay. Hang on here. Would you relax for a sec? That's what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. Grenade. <laughs> What? How are those? How are those missing? Can you explain to me how my shots were missing there? What the fuck? Is it because there's like just bone on their legs? The triple shots are going through their limbs? Could that be the case? Don't have enough for that. Great. I was trying to talk about Rizio 4, damn it. There we go. Ah, a little too late on that one. All right, not gonna try and be cheeky here. My goodness, what was I saying? Right, Resident Evil 4. I think, yeah, because the game will still be available, the original, and if they tried to go cheesy with this one, there's a very good chance it would be uh, way too cheesy and it would just be, uh, <laughs> you know, there's a lot of ways that can go wrong, right? So it seems like it's still gonna have a bit of the cheese there. Um, wasn't there a trailer where, where, like, Leon set a cow on fire and was like, he was like, got milk? Okay, I gotta be careful here. The got milk thing sounds very made up by me, actually. <laughs> That's possible. He definitely set the cow on fire. He definitely set that cow on fire. Probably did not say got milk. Maybe he said, Where's the beef? Will you calm down? You're burning through a lot of my ammo, good sir. All right. Good gravy. Oh, there's stasis right here. Yeah. Is that our last health pack? Yeah. One thing I will say that I didn't like about the recent trailer is uh, that they aren't. Okay, that door is still locked. It needs power is that they're doing, instead of like a QTE fight with Krauser, they're doing a, like, it looks like a, just a melee combat showdown. And I really dislike when, uh, when games introduce boss fights or long drawn out battles with mechanics that the game's not built around like that. Uh, okay, there's a bench, that's good. Let's go in these other rooms first. Like, I would say, oh, I should have saw, seen that, too. I think a really good example is the Naughty Dog oh. games, unfortunately. It's me. Oh, this is Nicole's office. You know how The Last of Us 2 had that, Uncharted 3, and I think 4 did, and so did Lost Legacy, where suddenly you just get in a big brawl with an enemy. And I, I don't like that, because they just don't ever feel good i kind of i think i blame kojima for that the metal gear solid games had those too and they just because the game's not constructed around melee combat they don't feel good so that's uh Personal that's my rant Dr. Nicole Brennan. with medication and zero g therapy patient harris is showing improvements 
If this continues, there might be hope for the others on Aegis 7. However, Dr. Mercer continues to interfere. He claims Harris's delusions are religiously significant. If I have to make a complaint, I will. I'm not losing my patient over unitology bullshit. Not again. You're a good person, Nicole. Dr. Nicole Brennan. Relocation inconclusive. Manual rig tracking is available. In oh, a side mission? Interesting. Okay, we have to do main mission stuff first. Okay. But yeah, uh, you know, give me a give me a QTE uh, cutscene any day over those kind of boss fights, huh? Just do it. Come on. This is all new to this uh, game, too. I like it. I feel like they really... Um, they, <laughs> they, they probably understand that everyone's going to just know that uh, Unitology is evil. That everyone playing this one's probably played the other ones. Uh, so they're just like, yeah, let's, let's get on with the show, huh? Ooh, a spooky. Ben, what in God's name is happening down there? Precisely that. God's work. How can you say that? These deaths at the colony. The paranoia, the hallucinations. You wanted a scientific analysis? That god guy, always a trickster, you know. Well, it all began after Loves a good trick. What are you so worried about? The marker is divine. We know this. Look, it'll be on board tomorrow. You can study it then. Put your mind at ease. At ease? People are dying. How can that be the transformation the teachings promise? We're witnessing a new beginning. Terrence. For unitology, for humanity. Of course, our faith is being tested. Everything <gasps> is about to change. That's what we're expecting. Hope you didn't didn't mean seal entry to that recording, because I just came up here and hit A to play. <laughs> Those holograms kind of look like junk, huh? Wasn't no the doctor from Star Trek Voyager. That's for, that's for, ding dang sure. Was there a something? No, she didn't have a computer. WTF? No computer? Okay. So. Ah, suck it. Suck on that, transphobes. Ha <laughs> ha. I thought I lost the credits there and uh, how violent that was. They just uh, flew on into the ceiling. Gone forever. But they weren't. They were right there. Yeah. But did you be be a tissue sample? Hang on here. What do you mean by a tissue sample? Like, like an arm? I can get you an arm. Okay. Is this not tissue?
Why are you so fucking picky, huh? Look at look how gross that is. Look at how gross your picture is. Exactly as gross as that picture. But you don't want it? Fine. Cannot believe this. What a what a fiasco, huh? We got bench. Let's uh, get a. Uh, um, yeah. Sure. We haven't ran into any doors that need them yet, so I'm kind of. Uh, I'm going to make a judgment call and say that they got rid of those doors, which is nice. Ooh, 35 pounds. Man. Fucking monster in here. 35 pound dumbbells. I know that's not a lot, but. Uh, Hey, for me it would be okay, okay, okay. The hell's that? Here. I think those are oh organs okay so that's a heart and those are kidneys why are those just out in the open i don't know There's nothing I could have done. The door is on standby for some reason. Maybe could have tried to uh, break open that. This glass bulletproof? No, sir. I was wrong. Ouch. So wait, they're they're growing people and harvesting their organs. What? Shit rolls downhill. Well, everything rolls downhill. That's gravity. Boom. Uh. So. Okay. I guess they are harvesting them. That's uh Hmm, a surprise. Oh, speaking of uh, <laughs> okay, We got to wait for them to do that. You do it. <laughs> Ouch. Oh, that was dumb. You gotta do better than that, Isaac. We've we've gone through half of our uh, plasma cutter ammo. This has been intense. They really uh, they really upped it from chapter one, didn't they? Not. Okay. You're wondering. Yes, I still see the green light of the credits and think, uh, ooh, health item. It's not meant to be. Emergency shower? Hell yeah. I want to be clean. No. I 
Isaac has a uh, a major major aversion to being clean. That's why he's always in the suit. The smell would be ooh, awful, awful, awful. He's gonna <laughs> electrocute me. Apparently not. Ooh. Shock pad. What is that? Daniels isn't answering her rig link. What's your status? I found a shock pad I can use on the barricade. I'm heading back there now. Watch the voltage on that pad. Not he probably mentioned else. that. I forgot. Oopsie. That's right, the hydrazine. The we're gonna use that ac ac acme. <laughs> yeah, it's famously uh, for uh, cartoons. I knew there was someone behind me. Okay, hold on a second. Throat's feeling a little parched. Talking too much baloney here. Ah, uh, yeah, baby. Ah, that's it. Okay. Why we can just shoot this? Why do we have to get the charging thingy? Hang on. I'm going to buy um a small med pack. We're gonna buy two small med packs actually. We'll see about the ammo thing. What's it mean by take cover? Like in here? Okay. <laughs> sure. Windows are bulletproof. We have run out of body bags. Okay. It's funny that someone will leave that note here, but sure. Oh, good aim. Remember, when you reach the morgue, find Captain Matthias's body. Get his rig codes, and the computer's all ours. An upgrade. Interesting. Security ah. Sorry, we are fuel. Fucked up losers, eh? Or, or oh no, that's just full. <laughs> I thought the the that was an E because of the okay. Very very silly. Um, it's time. Tool time. Ooh. Okay. Oh, chemical aid. Oh, well, I, I mean, 
there's been times where uh, I've been unable to sleep unless I use some uh, NyQuil, so that's alright. Try NyQuil, Nicole. Did you try it? Is this just the. Yeah, okay. I regret pressing that. Yeah, pulse. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Pulse, pulse, pulse. I know! You know that computer there, Alexa, you, you should just give me security clearance because you've seen how much I've uh, destroyed parts of your ship. <laughs> so why not? Okay, where where are you enemies at? Where are you at? Do I have to yank this out first? Ah! Oh. Didn't that say emergency shower? Like, why? Why did you have emergency shower and then this room? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Medical log, Doctor Nicole Brennan. So much for being paranoid. I repurposed this room to run counseling sessions without unitologists interfering. Now, it's the only place I feel safe. I recovered a limb after yesterday's attack. Genetically, it's human tissue with bizarre mutations. But it's just a sample. It's not enough to figure out a cure. I need... Wait, where's that report from engineering? Here. The engineer has pulled something out of machinery. Limbs missing, torso intact. Okay. Time for a real autopsy. Okay, so uh, she. Uh, <laughs> now it makes sense. Now it makes sense. This is actually a secret room. Haha. -ha. Where's the Where's the what's it then? The battery. Where is the battery? Ah. So we have to turn it off completely. That somehow got him. I'm not sure how. Oh, hi! You're really annoying, you know that? Owie! Was kind of a hot mess, but we survived still. Still no deaths, which is uh, very, very sweet, very, very swell. That's uh, just the way I came, okay. Wouldn't it be cool if I did this whole game without dying? Wouldn't that be cool? All right. I think it would be sweet. Probably, 
Very, very unlikely to happen, I think. If we were playing normal mode, uh, perhaps I could pull that off. In hard mode, something's going to get me, like, uh, what may uh, or may not come out of that uh, hole there. Very, very suspicious, that hole, is it not? Not since Harry Hole of the Snowman has there been a, a, a hole as baffling as that. I was hoping that would kill him, but, uh, no such luck. Now listen here, hole. If you do anything, I will come back here and, uh, Take a shit right down you, okay? I will squat down there, kind of go sideways, and hope it doesn't run down my leg. Okay. Oh, I thought those were eyes. I was like, huh? But no, that's actually a med pack. Wonderful. Security request retrieved. He left me. I woke in the dark with them scratching in the walls. Scratching like rats. And you will lock me in with them. Fuck it. I'll cut them out. I'll cut them out. Oh. I should have known. I need to I need to move. I need to move. What has happened here? Isaac. <laughs> what are you doing, Isaac? Okay. Oh shit. Hiding behind the wheelchair. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. Oh, may have spoke too soon. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I was really wondering if that was going to be the first death there. Would have been uh, appropriate, I think, after going, hmm, maybe I can pull this off without dying. Mercer, it's Karen's kind. You were in surgery, so I left this with Warwick. He'll be discreet. I just got the latest report from Aegis 7. The situation's worse than Captain Matthias will admit. 40% of the colony's population is now showing symptoms. Depression, hallucinations, more violence. People are dying down there. I know it's linked to the marker somehow, but I just don't have enough data. Or, sir, maybe I was wrong. We need answers. Hmm. By what? Any you, you're... Okay, okay. That patient, Brent Harris? Are you sure you're a licensed like medical professional? That was real clean, real nice, very well done. Uh, clearly you went to a great medical school to be able to cut your own throat like that. Level two, security clearance required. I, apparently this game has like a, uh, a accessibility setting that lets you know when like ugly gross stuff like that will happen i have mixed thoughts about that um in this case actually uh, would, i i don't keep it on obviously but i can understand why someone would in that case because uh, suicide is a it's a harsh harsh thing right and it's good to have uh, warnings about that stuff okay well i need this Like, I remember uh, watching Midsummer in theaters. Love that movie. 
but it opens with a really intense double suicide and it's like no indication of that in the MPAA rating or it's just MPA now um, but yeah you know that's something that I think uh, people should be warned about that's my thoughts and I haven't looked at the the, the detailed ESRB on this game, but I wonder if they do mention uh, there's uh, portrayals of suicide in it. I would imagine so. Hey. That ghost that uh, decided to open that was being uh, awfully friendly. Give us some credit, sir. So we have plenty of cash. Ooh, that reminds me. It does seem like the uh, the voice acting in the remake outside of Leon might be a little bit rough. The uh, Luis and uh, the Merchant both sound like a downgrade, and I noticed that they they didn't show any Ada in this trailer. I don't think, which is a maybe a little worrying. Yum! Damn, he's getting swole. That thing just injected him with, like, ultra steroids. Someone should tell uh, the people that portray superheroes in Marvel films about that thing. That'll, that'll really help out with their uh, insane work schedule that they have to have beyond to get that uh get that muscle mass right oh no oh dear we, we have to kill this thing <laughs> it could have been bad i forgot that it uh does that where it just like goes oh it's still alive that's good that's really good and we have no health. Oh shit. How is that still alive? It's just a pile of goop. <laughs> Jeez. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Are we still in chapter two? <laughs> Not that I want to stop, but uh, yeah. Our goal is to survive a chapter, uh, is to survive chapter two with no What's deaths. Do you have the captain's rig? Fuck me! No! Oh, transmitting codes now! I saw it, Hammond. A flying one turned the captain's body into another one of those things. The same must have happened to Chin. God, maybe the command computer has something. Uh, where's Daniels when you need her? Head back to the security checkpoint. It's safer there. At least I can upgrade your clearance. He doesn't sound so, um, like, nonplussed about that. <laughs> By now, there's a creature that brings things back to life. He's like, oh, God. Gosh, that's that's a quite uh, something. I, I don't, off the top of my head, remember if he's, like, a bad dude. Yeah, I know we're going the wrong way. I want to use that security clearance to... Um, if I can... Isaac. I'm here. What the hell's happening? The computer says the Ishimura's engines are offline. We're on a decaying orbit toward Aegis 7. Oh, God. I have to get to engineering. There's no time. That tram station's offline. Unless... Here. Head back to the flight deck. I'll guide you from there. If this damage report's right, there's a shortcut to engineering. I need to go back and see if there are any <laughs> items I can get with this new clearance. Uh, in particular, healing items, right? But that's not the end of the chapter, right? No. Okay. So 
So what could I open that I can now, huh? That's level two. Piece of crap. Is that a thing? I saw a glowy. Nope, just uh, sparks. Just Nicholas Sparks, that was him. Can't believe it. Author of uh, uh, kind of hacky, <laughs> hacky romance novels, I guess. I, I don't remember the name. It was the Notebook. He wrote the Notebook, didn't he? I remember I knew someone in high school that uh, I guess it's like an icebreaker with girls would carry around a DVD copy of the Notebook and like put it on his uh, like desk and everything and he did this for like months right months on end which is pretty funny Clearance confirmed. I think about that guy uh, like probably once every month <laughs> oh there we go there's some help okay there's I wonder maybe um music is making me nervous here this music is making me nervous uh, doesn't oh is that really just the start of a level right there I guess I could just backtrack all the way then wait this opened when did that happen Unbelievable. Oh, well. Uh, I'm sorry, what? Very confused by that door. <laughs> I smell trouble. <laughs> I smell trouble. With a capital T, which rhymes with P, which stands for, um, pool. Okay. I couldn't think of anything. I was like, this should be, uh, this should be fertile ground for a nice pun here, huh? But nothing. And there's, is there really nothing in this room? Another secret? No. That makes me sad. Really, there's nothing in here. Unless... Wait. Oh, is this just a roundabout way to get back here? Um, that's weird. I mean, I guess so. That's where we fought the captain, I guess. All right, fine. Oh, it, it totally is. So I just uh, wasted time. <laughs> ah. Maybe I just cut that bit out. Who knows? All right. Back here. I mean, I guess that's convenient for backtracking. Yeah, that's that's what that's for, clearly. Um, I just didn't put two and two together there. Bummer. Was this level two? Hi, hi. Okay, 
Did we have anything else exciting here? I guess. I want to see the map, damn it. How come there was like one instance of hold down that button for the map and now it just doesn't work? That's what I want to know. Good. Well, we're getting the med packs we wanted. That's uh That's amazing. That's uh that's winning. So we've uh This is a winning choice on my end here. I don't want to go all the way back though. I think that's enough. Cuz obviously there's other security levels here, so we'd have to come back anyway. That's my uh That's my mental calculus there. And enemies are just, like, respawning, so... Uh, yeah. Oh, there's... Okay. I didn't realize there was another what's-it there as well, so... Let's leave him be. <laughs> you can have fun. Fun, fun, fun. Alright, we'll buy one of those. And I'll buy uh, a yeah. I'll buy a yeah. I'll buy a yeah. Alright, so I think we're. I think we're good. Unless this is just a quick bit here. See, I held it down and it didn't do the thing. Oh, it's that? Alright. Yeah, let's just move on. We got what we wanted. Isn't that exciting? Really? I remember this being such a hot mess. Hey, this must be, uh, ends of the chapter, right? Main objective. Yes. Alrighty. Is there a, a. Oh, there's a store here. Oh, I can sell that. Right. And, uh. Oh, I have to get to a bench. What's the... What is a bench? <laughs> There's a bench in here. Yeah. So I want to see what this... I want to see what this does. Huh? Let's see. Oh, additional power node. So that's what that is. Oh, cool. Let's do that. Get some more damage on this baby. And... Yeah, I think reload's a smart idea. I 
that we are still in chapter two. Chapter two, I love you. By the way, uh, you uh, season four, part one. <laughs> it's funny that uh, Netflix is just slowly getting their way to a uh, weekly release schedule there, but that came out. I watched that. It was all right. Uh, it did not. Uh, it, it, I think it was a little bit too, uh, maybe a little bit too uh, wacky. And also, oh, this is actually exactly what happened on you. Uh, so you can probably uh, understand what I mean by it being too wacky. All right. Through there? No way. Can't believe it's through another door. Why am I hearing a monster, but I don't see monster? Monster, show yourself! He didn't answer. There he is! There's another monster! Ah! Oops. <laughs> Forgetting the buttons. Oops. I don't know what that achievement is. Lab rat. Maybe we're in chapter three now. You'll need your thrusters to reach it, but that lift shaft should take you straight down to engineering. Oh, uh, should it? Oh, completed. Okay. Well. That concludes chapter two. Hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to just briefly stop here. I'm going to keep playing, but uh, do the, the uh, effects and uh, manipulation of the space-time continuum. Uh, chapter three won't be available until later, but I will be playing it immediately. Whoa! Whoa!